Hi everybody, so we've just finished making this. It's graphene, it's in the previous video, but it's not the only thing that I've been up to today. So, I want to show you something else. What I've also been up to is this. It's the bottom of a solar kettle, as it happens, and more importantly, this, which is finishing off in my wind turbine generator. It's a nice bottom, it now fits, and everything's ready to go to do the tests before we get that into the wind turbine. Incidentally, the Tinkercad STL files for this are in the description of this video. So if you want to replicate this, if you like the look of it, you want to give it a go, it's yours. And the reason I can do all of those things is because of the 3D printers. 3D printers are not something that I worship. They're, they're a tool that I think releases your creativity because you don't have to stand over them. They just do the job for you, which is brilliant. Some people said that one of the issues with 3D printing is the time they take, and sure, they take a bit of time. That was 10 hours. But I did not sit there with a quart of gin in a magazine for 10 hours watching it slowly print. I'd have to be a nut to do that. Now I set it going and then went off and made some blood graphite. Because I don't need to do anything with it, it will do itself. All I really needed was the hour to draw the thing and then two minutes to set it up and I'm done. And that's why it's so much more productive because you don't have to do anything with it. I've got three of them obviously sent by Elegoo and they're the, the Pro, the Plus and the Max and we've had them for about eight months or so now and they're going really well. In about a year, after I've had them for a year, I'll do a progress report and we'll see how well they're doing. I do know they're a bit difficult to buy because they sell like hotcakes and I'm not surprised they sell like hotcakes. They've been a good machine for me. Now, um, Elegoo are also doing something and on the 6th of June they've got a surprise live event that I'm going to run. So I'm going to run a live event on the 6th of June in association with Elegoo. Can't tell you any more right now about it but that's what's up and coming. So put a date in your diary for the 6th of June. Grab these Tinkercad files if you want yourself a generator. And watch out for the solar kettle because I was looking at a 1956 edition of Popular Mechanics, the April uh, edition I think, which was talking about solar invention in the USA. And if you remember the video 1930, the 50s were the heyday of solar invention in the USA when they came up with some really amazing stuff. So we'll be doing some stuff on that. Now, People often say I get an awful lot done and is it any wonder? I mean I have three 3D printers which are just awesome and it's having, like having three little servants that do all the work for me. So I come up with an idea, do a drawing and they do the work, not me. So no wonder it appears that I do a lot. But I wanted to do this video to give you a heads up on um, the generator is finished and the files are there ready to download for anybody who wants them. We have a secret on June the 6th when we're going to have a live event to announce what Elegoo have been up to. Um, so the live event will be on the 6th of June, which I believe is a Tuesday. It's going to run from 7pm to 10pm, so don't forget to jump over and join us then. And the rumour is that Elegoo are going to do a prize draw giveaway, so you have a chance of winning one of their brand new secret machines that we're going to be talking about in the live review. Anyway, I hope to see you there. I'm looking forward to it, actually. I'm quite excited myself, and I, I know what it is. And then finally, some of the projects we're going to be doing on solar as we come into the summer. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you very much for watching. Watch out for everything, and please do remember to like and subscribe.